now or never. Let's do this. Hi, and welcome to 101.1 KDNO, the Dino. I'm your host, DJ Jurassic, and it's Sunday, which means it's Show Me Sunday here at the station, where listeners are encouraged to show their privates in public, or call in if they see somebody showing their privates in public. So, let's start off by taking some phone calls. Hi, caller, you're on the air? Yo, man, I'm totally showing my privates on 4th Street right now. Wow, that is so risque. We really push the limits here on the dyno. Who is your daddy? Alright, let's take another call. Caller, you're on the air? Hey, I saw someone's privates because of this station. You kids these days! Alright, well, you know what? You're too old to be listening to my show anyway, so I'll leave you with two words. Suck one. Who is your daddy? Haha, <laughs> alright. Now we're gonna have a special guest here in the studio. A deaf mute lady. Okay, here she comes. Alright, you uh, listeners out there can't obviously can't see her and you can't hear her because she's deaf and mute, but she's definitely in the studio. Whoa! She's taking off her clothes! There's a naked woman in the studio right now. You, you obviously can't see her, and once again, I stress, she is deaf and mute, so you can't hear her either. But I assure you, there is a naked woman in the studio right now. We are really pushing the limits here on the dyno. And we'll leave you guys with the song. Son, what the hell are you doing? Uh, uh... Did you put yourself live on the air? Maybe. I could very well fire you for this, but I won't. Cause you're so goddamn good at your actual job. Get out there and make some dollar dollar bills, son. Let's do work. Yeah, yes, sir. Hello? I wish I was a little bit taller. I wish I was a baller. I wish I had a girl who looked good. I would call her. Wish I had a rabbit in a hat with a bat and a six form bar. I wish I was like six foot nine so I could get with Leoshi. Cause she don't know me, but yo, she's really fine. You know, I see her all the time everywhere I go. And even in my dreams, I can scheme a way to make her mine. Cause I know she's living fat. Her boyfriend's tall and he plays ball. So how am I gonna compete with that? Cause when it comes to playing basketball, I'm always last to be picked. And in some cases, never picked at all. So I just lean up on the wall. Or sit up in the bleachers with the rest of the girls who came to watch they man ball. Dad, y'all, I never understood black. While the jocks get the fly girls and me, I get the hood rats. I Tell them scat, skittles, kebab, got hit with a body, but in the hospital for talking that mess. I confess it's a shame when you living in a city that's the size of a box and nobody knows your name. Glad I came to my senses, like quick, quick, got sick, sick to my stomach, overcoming my thoughts of me and her together, right? So when I asked her out, she said I wasn't a type. I wish I was a little...